And see, that's why I like the senior uh, veterans. They laugh as I walk by. So that's an indication that it was very much different than one time out there, and it actually worked. And I think it's funny. And that, um, you know, that Jim Riley, Joe Zillig, Harry Rice, Bernard Lachance, DJ Dave, Perlita Quinwan, Elton Anderson, Don Wiley, 1961 Oyster Cracker Man, Bitted Bat 4, Blue Boy Boxes, GPS Paso Robo, Rapist Night, Red, Randy, Rape, Gordon, and Ellery, Jim Hall, Bill Duvall, and their personal war out here against me is the thing that ruined it, see? Especially when, like, senior elderly veterans think it's funny, you know? So they've watched you guys destroy it just by a simple reaction. That you, Bernard, that your carnila tanks that you keep bringing through wrecked everything and you lied to everyone. And so then I ask, then I ask Jewish Colonel Mel Cole, Colin Power, Joint Chief of Staff, were you guys a part of the Sunday morning AD show, right? Breakfast Club? And so, see, Bernard, those military guys in Lockheed and the Navy and all them who's like in the police officers, firefighters, those, those groups. I just watch you guys decimate the city. Now, Colin Powell and Jew Jewish Colonel Malkov and his friends, judges of staff, get the, they get a big, big, they get to reacquire with the groups of you destroyed. Because see, Bernard, military bases are like the old forts. And see, since you guys argued over it, Bernard, Harry, Ellery's, Pickens Street, Jamaica Street, Aurora, here, there, throughout the nation, they get to reacquire that which you took away, and they actually get to prove through your little carny tanks, Bernard, of La Dump, how it ruined everything, and you guys haven't made it past several military bases, Joe, because of your argument, so your own purpose served as a defense against your stupidity, Joe Zilli, Indian man, see, and they get to prove how you guys decimated everybody for no reason, so they get to acquire a piece that they was taken away, but also, GPS, Basil Robo, Rapist Knight, Whispering Faggot, the Fairmount, or, you know, your your obsession over Crown Hill, Joe, or Fairmount, they actually get to prove, see, honorable military burials, Bernard, Harry, Joe. So as you obsess over that lion man with the crown and the Judah with Dave, they also get to Jewish Colonel Mel Cobb, Colin Powell, Joint Chiefs of Staff, and the military get to acquire the business, Red Randy and them, ran and screwed up the whole world with. So they actually get to reinvest, protect the investment, they actually get to reinvest in you guys' stupidity and make money off of your mistake. And then, here's the best kicker. Since their senior ranking military, say, Jewish Colonel Mel Kolb and his friends, Joint Chiefs of Staff, and that group, they can actually get to go to military war colleges and teach the new recruits that you're supposedly doing, Joe, how you miserably failed, Joe, Harry, Bernard, they get to point out the flaws of your war, Bernard, La Chancellor, Carney, because they may not have wanted to been buried in your Carney tanks, Bernard, that you run, because there was probably a better way. And then when the Red Randy and you guys came in with your Carney tanks, professing that, you know, the little Freeman is the best video game player in the world, or that group, Steve Jones or whatever, they get to actually prove that you're wrong. And so Jewish Colonel Mel Cobb, Colin Powell, and those higher ranking officials, judges of staff, actually become the better video game players than the rest of you because your personal repeat of attack to cover up rapes and murders and screwing shit up out here. Understand, Joe? Indian fader out? Robo Knight? It proves that you guys <laughs> destroyed it on purpose because you guys were sickos over a religious then they'll tell you a lesson through an Indian egotist called Joe Zillig or Harry Race or Pickett Street, Jamaica Street or the All-American Antilla. So as you guys destroyed and decimated Starbucks is because you guys were gay, you didn't like girls or whatnot, didn't think that it's been watched the whole time so Lockheed gets to reacquire NASA. IHS, Google, Microsoft, Apple, all those entities that are interested, who want to work together, the military branches, the fighter pilots, the SEALs, those people who watch it all come down in your lie, Harry, the pain, yeah, it actually proves it was there until David had to have his own personal battles 
So yes, David, battle on with your friends. But then those who are higher ranking than you get to reacquire what they lost. So if Jewish Colonel Mel Cole and Colin Powell were a part of the Sunday morning 80s show, the 80s music, and the Breakfast Club, and they have a different meme of what reality really was and watch the kids come up through and destroy it, then they get to reacquire and reinvest in your massive mistakes. And I say, I'm not going to fight you. So how do you win, David? And now all that, all that crap you guys do. That's why I set up a pile of trash and say, here, I lose. Remember, Joe, if you're going to go to the black and white and you're going to make fun of food and make people fat and be that kind of fag and shit and make people commit suicide, I say, cornflakes snap and cardboard snaps. You forced me into the Jonestown mess, Joe, and I didn't want it, and you fucked it all up. So they get to point out all the flaws of those cults, all the flaws of the gangs that were created of it, how you guys got Negro sitting around trying to play Jehovah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Sit there forever. But those who are higher ranking watching over all of it, the trembles, all that stuff, <laughs> Black Eid and all that, those who have actually seen a reality rise and fall, Joe, get to reacquire with the high ranking officials that you guys screwed over on those families you victimized. So if you like a prison life, Karen, Joe, Don, you guys pretty much trapped yourselves in with David running around professing to be God or the Messiah of the earth. That's why you don't... Jo Adam, John, Dave, you got uh, Harry, Robo Knight, your obsession over Crown Hill or Fairmount. I'll let run it. It's not the way you're properly supposed to be honorably buried. But those of you who guys were smart asses too, it's called fraternization. Those higher ranking officials that actually earned it and worked it and went through battle. Like a POW, maybe Mr. Kit McC McCain, who's sick and tired of you guys running torture tanks with your Lacarni, Red Randy, and El Cortez. They get to acquire your whole business and then watch you guys run it and point out all the flaws. Like you guys pointed out all the flaws. They go, <laughs> failure. You guys got to fix it.